The EU has no more than two months to solve the migrant crisis and save its passport-free Schengen zone. That was the stark warning European Council President Donald Tusk gave on Tuesday. He was speaking to the European Parliament in Strasbourg, ahead of an EU summit in March that will focus on the continent's worst refugee crisis since World War II. The statistics over the Christmas period are not encouraging, with over 2,000 arrivals to the EU per day, according to Frontex. The March European Council will be the last moment to see if, if our strategy works. If it doesn't, we will face grave consequences such as the collapse of Schengen. This week, Austria became the latest EU country and member of the Schengen area to tighten border controls. 500 troops will be deployed at the main crossing point between Austria and Slovenia to check all migrants and their bags. We want these regular controls, said the Austrian Chancellor. They're important because they aim to know who's coming and they offer a chance to send back refugees who do not want to apply for asylum and who are not willing to cooperate. Austria has also been rolling out a three-and-a-half-kilometer wire fence at its border with Slovenia, a first within the Schengen area. And Hungary says it stands ready to build one at its border with Romania any day if migrants switch to that route.